While everybody else has crashed early, and it's not even midnight, I might add, but I think they're saving their strength for tomorrow night. Um, and I, I get up last, so it makes sense that I'm up this late, but I figured this would be a good opportunity to show kind of the area that we're all um, cohabitating at, in, at a, a day and night. But uh, right now, of course, it's night, so let me show you what it's like at night. This, of course, is the main area where people hang out. The couches are good for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I mean, a good dozen bodies if nobody stretches out lengthwise. And most of the time, I think it's either spent here or over in the area with, uh, I don't know, cages, swing, cage swings. I don't know what you even call them. But um, this is a really nice area. So you can just hang out, relax, and just chill for a while. Uh, but it's a nice common area, so that's what's good about this area. These are the basket swings, and it's a little balcony area where you get a great view of the ocean and the cities at night and, or in the day. It's a really nice area that people kind of hang out and mostly read. Um, it's quite uh, relaxing. Now, if there's one little issue I have with it, it's the safety level. This um, railing, if you can call it that, is pretty low, so one slip, you'd be dead. I mean. 100% dead, you'd have zero chance. So I wouldn't mind it if it were a little higher, maybe this high, I would you'd interfere with your view a little bit, but um, yeah, you got people partying and hanging out if you had kids, just not a good idea to have it that low, but you know, I don't judge. To my right is the infinity pool. I uh, can't go in it right now because I'm dressed and um, I'm just not in the mood, but it's actually very nice. It's extremely comfortable right now, even for late at night. So the, depending on the weather, it might be a little cold or cool, but it's, yeah, I could easily swim right now if I had a good reason to, but I guess I don't. Um, anyway, it's really nice and a great view again, and people just do laps or just, I just kind of, well, I do laps, other people just kind of hang on and drink beer, but uh, I do like the infinity pool a lot. Highly recommend. Now the deck chairs or suntan or tanning chairs, they seem to get used a little more during the daytime than the night, although I wouldn't be surprised if people did use them at night. Um, but they're very comfortable, very relaxing. I have not gotten any like tanning done, which is kind of a shame, but we're by the time I get up, we're always going out and doing stuff, so there's just no time to laze about the place and uh, get some, some rays. But it's nice knowing they're here if I ever get around to doing something like that. So. I like having them, just haven't used them. From this angle, you can kind of see the whole area and the stairs. So in this place, there's a lot of stairs that go down to levels of rooms, and there's a lot of stairs that go up to levels of rooms. So this is kind of the center, the home base, if you will. And the kitchen's off to my right. This here is the game room and entertainment room. We got foosball, we got pool, got a TV, which we watched a, a kind of a sad game where the uh, lions lost to the uh, Cowboys, but we won't talk about that, even though I already did. And a nice door here that opens up to another little balcony. Low railing once again, but uh, I mean the view, you can get the sunset, but you can also get the Hills and Hotel. I don't know if you could see it in my last shot, but uh, we've got some fun art here. Hola. This is the kind of the common bathroom and shower, and it's all glass walls, so you know, people have telescopes. Well, they're gonna see what you look like. Um, although there's nobody that lives right there, so that's kind of good, but yeah. I mean, most people don't have anything to worry about, but if you're very self-conscious, then yeah, you might wanna not strip all the way down in here. Up here, we have another one of these uh, kind of cage swings. Very comfortable. They're very difficult to get into with one hand, um, but it can be done. I kind of like it so you can uh, kind of just circle around and see everybody and read or do a drink or do whatever you want and uh, get a nice view of the ocean. You just have to keep yourself pointed the right direction because that's not easy to do. Yeah, okay, no, no, back. Now from this angle you can kind of get an idea of what the infinity pool looks like and the, kind of the common area. The view, which of course right now is just darkness and yeah, I don't even see any boats out there. It's uh, it's pretty dark. Some city, some lights on the cityscape there, but overall, it's not much of a view this time of night. It's still cool though, and you can kind of hear, you can hear stuff. Well, now I hear a car alarm, but yeah, 
in general. I'm now at the massive kitchen table, which is really cool. The, it's like you took a huge tree and they sliced a midsection off of it. So there is some, there are some holes in it, but it's a really cool design, very unique shape. And you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, well, 10, and there's 10 of us. So this works out really well. It's been fun to have uh, a few dinners here and play games here. And, it works exceptionally well. This is the kitchen, which gets used quite a lot. Uh, we have a cook, or maybe two cooks, that do a lot of the food preparation, but we also come in here at the times they're not there and get our own food and you know have some beers or some snacks or make our own meals. Um, overall, it's been very, very nice to ha have this, you know, access to all this food and drink too. There is a bar, <laughs> there is a bar. The bar area has a number of, well, spirits ready to go. We've got our own spirits and wine, pretty much ever you can think of. Of course, the beer is in the refrigerator, but this place is well stocked. And for a party this size that likes to have fun, I'm not even sure this is gonna be enough to get us through New Year's. So there might be more booze runs in the future. Okay, that is it for the common area where everyone hangs out. I can't really get people's rooms right now because they're in them. Um, and I've already done my room. So yeah, this is a nighttime review of the common area. Maybe I'll try it again in the daytime, but I think it would be kind of hard with everybody kind of doing their own thing and thinking, what are you doing? You're in my way. So uh, yeah, it's been really cool. This is really, really nice. And uh, I guess it's a good thing everyone went to bed early. So I got a chance to share. That's it for now. Cheers.